And so, the adventure begins. Hey Wanderers, let's juice. As you know, on the Adventures of Boogie this month of February has been self-care, self-love February. So I decided to juice and to prep for my juice, I went on Amazon, did a search to find the best bottle that suited my needs and I found it. Links for the bottles I purchased are in the description below. But feel free to get whatever suits your needs. I don't know if I was just raised this way, but anytime I get a new item, I clean it before I utilize it. Eats. If you are from the Chicagoland area, hopefully you know about this place. If not, I'm about to put you on. Great produce, great prices. Just always fresh. Love it. They just built a new location in the south suburbs of Chicago. After a little bit of research, I realized a cup of vinegar and some salt and some water in the sink and leaving my fruits and vegetables in there just to soak and get the grime and the dirt and the wax, pesticides and everything else that comes on your fruits and veggies. It helps get it, gets it, get it off. So I let it soak for a couple hours. I made a huge mistake though. I forgot to take the stickers off of some of the fruit. So before you put it in, make sure you take those stickers off and just let it soak for however long you need. Let's be honest, juicing can be tedious. To make it a little bit easier on myself, I break it up in days. Whatever I feel comfortable doing that day, I might grocery shop one day, and then uh, clean the fruit one day and the vegetables one day, then cut it the next day. So it's whatever works best for you, but break it up if you can. I let the fruit and the vegetables dry on a towel once I'm done. First recipe is Morning Glow Detox Juice. Golden beets, large carrots, oranges, ginger, turmeric, and lemon. I found for me that you can add what you want, take away what you want. This is just the base. Do as many oranges as you want. Do as many beets as you want. Just make it ideal for you. This is just a base recipe to help you get going. Up next is the Herbal Green Detox Juice. So we have cucumbers, green apples, celery, spinach, cilantro, basil, ginger, and lemon. Again, make it what you want. If you don't like spinach, add kale. If you have an allergy to celery, you know, add something else. It's whatever you want to make it. Last recipe for this video is the Berry Beet Detox Juice. We have red beet, spinach, purple cabbage, lime, and I mix some frozen mixed berries in there. Just a tip that made the process a lot easier for me when I was cutting up the fruits and the vegetable, I would cut them up in the specific recipe that I had for it and put all the ingredients in one Tupperware container. So we have the morning glow in one, we have the herbal green in one, and we have the berry beet juice all in one in the Tupperware. And it just made it easier for me. Yesterday. It's time to juice finally. I found this process to be really dope to involve kids. Um, as you can see, my nephew, and later on, you'll see my niece um, were excited to help me and it gets them excited to try new fruits and vegetables that they may not be um, inclined to try on their own. To be able to help make something made them more inclined to try something new. Time for a tip. 
to collect the pulp in that container, I put a garbage bag or a grocery bag in there to help the cleaning process go a lot smoother than before. Um, just one less thing to have to clean, honestly. As you can see, it's a very, very messy process sometimes. So to be organized beforehand and to use this tip of the garbage bag in there, it just made the process a whole lot easier and cleaner. My niece was thrilled to come down from her e-learning break <laughs> and come help Juice. She was ecstatic. I will be mindful though, the, the juicer is very, very loud. So be mindful if you have little ones of their ears. And other than that, we had a blast making juices together. For the berry beet mix, um, a big part of the recipe is the berries. I did not want to juice berries, so I got some frozen mixed berries and blended it with the beet juice that I had already made, and it was delicious. Feel free to blend in whatever frozen fruits you want to in the mix, in any of the recipes, it will be phenomenal. Another thing will be to blend in some sea moss gel to make it extra healthy. We all know fruits and vegetables are healthy, but I wanted to take some time to show some of the ingredients that I threw in these juices, some of the specific benefits of spinach, cilantro, beets, oranges, apples. So feel free to take time to read those. These will also be listed on my Instagram page at The Adventures of Boogie if you want to take time to read these separately. But I thought it was very, very important to educate on what the specific benefits are of these juices that I'm listing. What are some juices you're making? Leave in the comment section what juice recipes you enjoy, what ingredients you can't live without when you're juicing, anything that will spruce up your juices. Last tip, like I said, it can get a little messy and if you're adding the blender with the juicer, one thing I like to do once I'm done using the blender is put some, fill it up with water, fill it up with soap and blend it to help clean the blender it makes a way easier so much easier so there's a little blender hack a blender tip for you all and that's all i have for you today i hope you enjoyed this video if you did follow like and subscribe more content is on the way